Hello? Oh, you, you answered. Hi, June. I do not think that, uh... What? No, nothing. Uh, I just got into town. Yeah, me too. Well, I, I just wanted to check in before I saw you to see, to see if you're okay with everything. No, not really. Yeah, no, no, of course not. Of course you're not. I mean, I, I'm not either. Uh, well, I will see you in a little bit then. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Should we go back to the room? There are oysters waiting. I don't like them either, but they're Lily's favorite. Come on. I'm actually kind of allergic. Even with everything, it feels really good to be with you guys right now. It just feels right. I don't think I've ever seen you cry like this, Mary. In, in all the years I've known you, I, I've never seen you cry like this. Yeah. <laughs> I don't, I don't know, maybe, maybe I've changed a little bit, I don't <laughs> I can't remember the last time we were all together. When Hank gets here, we should have him sign. Okay, but there's not that much room left on the card because Mary's note took up a lot of space. I had a lot to say. Oh, here, I'll, I will do it, I'll do it. Hi, Hank, hey, 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 hey. long time to no see. Um. That's very sweet. Thank you. Uh, no, it's not. It's not for you. It's for Lily's parents from all the girls. So could you sign it? I'm okay. Thanks. Okay. Did you think that the way that Hank was crying was kind of strange? What do you mean? I just, I just mean that, like, I don't know how Lily would have felt if she saw him crying like that. It kind of seemed like he was crying for attention, not because he was actually that sad. They loved each other a lot. You can't blame someone for how they choose to grieve. I know, I, I know that, and obviously he's sad, but, like, was he that sad? We're all sad. Why? We know that their relationship wasn't that great at the end. What? What? You're the one who told me that. You shit on him all the time. That's not the point, June. I, I know, I know. I just mean, like, if somebody should have been crying like that, it should have been one of us. Like, I could have been crying like that. I'm not really an easy crier, but like, I could have been crying like that. Lily must have died with a lot of regrets. Why? Because she didn't choose the path the rest of us chose? She didn't choose any path. 
We all ran as far away from the cesspool as we possibly could, and she just stuck around for what? For a boy? And I'm not even saying that's such a bad thing. I just feel like she might have had some regrets. Like she turned into a different person after high school. I could barely recognize her. How do you even know what Lily's been up to these past couple of years, huh? What? What? You were obviously in love with her boyfriend and she distanced herself from you. I don't think she regretted that, oh to be honest. Oh my God, I'm not in love with him. I'm not, why are you guys always saying that? I don't, I don't even think he's that attractive. He's objectively very attractive. No, 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 Dora, I'm sorry. You can't choose now to conveniently chime in. Wait, someone's a little sauced. I think Lily would be happy that we're all at the Carlisle. Do you remember at Yaya's 70th when Lily ate like a whole tray of those oysters and then peeped all over Uncle Julian's chair? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, what have you been up to, June? I mean, we've barely heard from you. Um, well, I'm actually, I'm in the process of getting a book published. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Where? Uh, Melville House. Hmm, haven't heard of it. Well, that's because you're not really a big reader, right? Did you two try the Lopchong Bao I brought? Okay, that's disgusting. Uh, it's called Melville House. But if you're not in the literary scene, it makes sense that you haven't heard of it because it's just, it's small. <laughs> Did you try the Lop Chong Bao I brought? It's really good. I don't like Lop Chong Bao. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm getting a room tonight at the Carlisle uh, and all the girls are coming and we're ordering oysters, all of these favorites. <laughs> You should come. I don't really think that's a good idea. Um, well, you have to, because all the girls really want you there. The Carlisle room three. I'm sorry I yelled at you earlier, Dora. That was, that was really not nice of me. It's okay. None of us are thinking straight right now. It's okay. Who is it? Uh, it's Hank. I, I, I told him that we would be here and he kind of begged me to come. This is supposed to be just us. I know. I know, that, that's, that's exactly what I told him, but I guess he just kind of showed up. He must be really upset. Fine, let him in. you say that because um it's not like it's not like we stopped being friends it, we more just kind of spent more one-on-one -on -one time together and talked things out and cleared stuff up um 
more private stuff. That's probably why she didn't mention it to you. What? Hmm? What? When did you two see each other? Because we spent every summer woofing it on. Oh, um, over winter term. You spent all your winter terms at Brown. No, that's not true. I always came home for a couple of days. Um, and what about you and Lily? What do you mean? Um, like, at, at the end, you two weren't together at the end, right? No. We were. Oh. I didn't know that. You definitely knew that. No, I didn't. I really did not know that. I actually had no idea. I thought I locked. Sorry, I didn't realize someone was in here. Uh, I can, I can leave. No, no, stay. You still have that scar? Yeah. That's how scars work. <laughs>